kiddos. I hope you are at home and staying safe. So this morning we are going to be talking about the true meaning of Easter. So what is the true meaning of Easter? The true meaning of Easter? Mm, a big Easter basket with lots of eggs, lots of chocolate, and a giant bunny in the middle. Easter eggs, yay, candy. I love the Easter bunny. I love to dye Easter eggs. All right, so Miss Angel asked me, what is the true meaning of Easter? And I was thinking about it, and I think I found it. So come, come on, I'll show you. It's right in here. Just, just come on. True meaning of Easter. I think I found it. Just, just come on in. See, somebody gave me this, and I think I, think I found it. Because these are really awesome. Cadbury cream eggs. Yes. So I, I'm pretty sure. I mean, I, you know. I could be wrong, but that's what I'm thinking. I'm going with Cadbury eggs. No. All right. Enough with the guesses. Let's go to a place where I know that we can get the correct answer, and that is the Bible. We can always go there and trust the Bible to give us the correct answer for any of our questions. So today, if you'd like to follow along with me, we're going to be reading out of Matthew 28, and it's verse 1 through 10. And I've invited a couple of our friends to come along and read with us. After the Sabbath at dawn, on the first day of the week, Mary Magdalene and the other Mary went to look at the tomb. There were a violent earthquake, for an angel of the Lord came down from heaven, and going to the tomb, rolled back the stone and sat on it. His appearance was like lightning. And his clothes were white as snow. The guards were so afraid of him that they shook and became like dead, dead men. The angel said to the woman, Do not be afraid, for I know that you, who you are looking for, for Jesus, who was crucified. He is not here. He has risen, as, just as said. Come here, come and see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell the disciples, He has risen from the dead and has gone ahead of you into Galilee. There you will see him now. I have told you so. So the women hurried away from the tomb and afraid with with yet filled with joy, and ran to tell the disciples. Suddenly Jesus met them. Greetings, he said. They came to him, clasping his feet, and worshipped him. Then Jesus said to him, them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee. There they will see me. Wow, what an amazing story. Thank you so much for sharing that. There is no greater story than the story of Easter to show God's power and love for us, that the Lord Jesus Christ rose from the dead, that Jesus Christ is alive. Jesus conquered the grave. That, my friends, is the true meaning of Easter. So as you go throughout your day, I hope and pray that you just remember the true meaning and that Jesus is alive, that we need to share that with our friends, share that with your neighbors, and just be grateful and praise Him that Jesus Christ is alive. I hope you guys have a safe and happy Easter. Until next time, I miss you guys and hope to see you soon.